Good morning everyone. Today is May 1st. It is Sunday and it is Lower Schools Week A. I am ABS and this is ACS Doha Live. So today's news is that grade 12 exams begin tomorrow. It is from May 2nd to the 20th. So good luck to everybody. And I know you're working so hard to study and we all hope that you do very well. Um, college counseling information is for all the 12th graders, all the 11th graders, my bad. Please schedule your mandatory individual college counseling meeting. Interviews are May 12th. Um, Islamic history competition for non-native students happened. Some of our lower and middle school students attended a competition held in Alcor, and it was on Thursday. And for the girls, they represented our school and they won prizes for second and third place. Second place got 2,500 reals and third place 2,000. So here is the girls team in both trans. So well done to the boys and girls who represented ACS at the competition, thank you very much. And the Lower School Talent Show is coming up. The first round of Classrooms auditions will happen this week, so good luck to all you Lower School students and I hope that you guys have a lot of fun with that. And so now we will go to Sports with Natalie. Bye! Good morning, I'm Natalie and here's your sports for today. So the swim team has returned today from the MEUC in Dubai. Here are the 25 swimmers at the airport as they travel to the gala on Thursday. We look forward to hearing the results when the team all arrives back in Doha. Upcoming swim events will be on Wednesday, May 3rd, under 10 and under 11, QPPSSA Gala, and on May 9th, under 8 and under 9, QPPSA Gala. And up next is Lifestyle with Nivea. Good morning everyone and welcome to Lifestyle Sunday. Um, with the arrival of May, we officially uh, exit spring and enter summer. Personally, I prefer the winter here in Doha, but summer is a whole lot of fun. We get to enjoy the warmth and do many summer activities. I know that the summer in Doha can be a little tricky because it because of the extreme heat conditions, but that does not mean we can make the best we can't make the best out of it. And so for today's lifestyle segment, I'll be sharing some summer activities ideas that you guys can uh, try to work out. So go hunting for summer foods. Um, it's during the summer that many fruits and vegetables like watermelon, mango, etc. grow are available and they're absolutely delicious. Go swimming. There are so many clubs and many home compounds that have their own swimming pools. It's a great sport and a lot of fun to cool off during the summer. Read a book. Reading is a great habit to have in the summer and during the summer in Doha we spend a lot of time indoors because it's way too hot in the afternoons. So try to learn, I mean try to read a book and try to grow the habit of reading. And I know that the summertime ha um, has many shops with colorful collections so take this if you're a person who loves to stick with um, mono monochromatic colors then embrace this change try to go shopping try to get more color into your lifestyle um, and with only 45 days to go for the summer vacation take this time to talk to your parents and um, plan your summer holidays. You can decide the new, you can talk about the new skills that you want to learn, the new places you want to see, the things that you need to finish for the next school year. And you can also talk to your teachers and ask them for summer goal suggestions. And this is a great time to do that. So hopefully you guys are, those activities got you guys excited for the summer holidays. I know I am. And hope you enjoyed today's lifestyles. And up next, let's go to local weather. Hi, I am Noah. Here's the weather for today. The current temperature is 26 degrees Celsius.
Today will be sunny and warm again after a few days of clouds. The high of today will be 33 degrees Celsius. As always, drink plenty of water to stay hydrated and wear your sunscreen and a hat. Ha and have a great start of the week. Bye.